There's absolutely no shame in trailering to Sturgis. You know, you always got those young guys who are saying, ah, you're not a real biker unless you ride to Sturgis. Well, some of us have done it several times, and some of us have done it before you were born. And some of us live in Florida, and it's a 4,000-mile round trip, and most of those roads just suck. But uh, I thought I'd tell you how I'm going to do it, and because I don't need a trailer a lot. So I rent one from U-Haul. So let me show you how not to get stuck with the wrong trailer at U-Haul. Okay, so here's what you're going to run into at U-Haul. This is the standard motorcycle trailer. Uh, you can tell by the MT designation. This is way too small for a Harley touring bike. I know I've made that mistake. Um, the road glides, street glides, 12 inch shocks, that ramp isn't long enough and you'll get hung up trying to get into that trailer. And they're all about the same. And if you've got a, a bike that uh, probably has higher than 13 inch shocks or a higher ground clearance, I think you're fine. This is another motorcycle trailer, but they call it, hello, somebody's going by. Uh, they call it a ramp trailer, but it has an RT designation. And you can see that ramp is a whole lot bigger but you have to watch out for this this one has no wheel chalk so there's two types and you have to make sure that they order you one with the wheel chalk now I have reserved mine uh, I even found the number for the trailer and uh, it has the uh, motorcycle wheel chalk in it. Uh, so there is two types. But just make sure it isn't one of these tiny ones. If you've got a touring bike with 12 inch shocks, you'll never get in it. Well, I hope you found this helpful. Didn't want any of you to get uh, stuck with a small trailer like I did, learning the hard way. But uh, yeah, if you're, uh, if you're trailing, check it out and uh, see if your bike's high enough for those small trailers. Hmm, sun's out. It's Florida, you never know. So cool. If you found it interesting, uh, give me a big thumbs up.